A non-governmental organization, Alfred Komalafe Educational Foundation, has called on government at all levels to allocate special funding for science, technology, engineering and mathematics STEM education in Nigeria. Dr. Alfred Komolafe, founder of the organization, an Ibadan Indigen and 4th District Commissioner in Wisconsin, United States of America, made the call in Ibadan during the launch of STEM Clinic by the organization. The UTME STEM Clinic was launched by the foundation in collaboration with the Mathematics Association of Nigeria and the Science Teachers Association of Nigeria. It's very important in this uh, age that we have now, and um, Nigeria is lacking the behind, and there's a need for us uh, and uh, for the government to heavily uh, 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 fund STEM subjects. So what we're doing today is that uh, we're launching a program that will get this program off. We're going to start from uh, primary school to secondary school. So it's, it's critical for government, and government cannot do it alone. NGOs uh, can come in, and that's why we're coming in. Uh, to help uh, make sure that the next generation are not lacking behind. At this time, it is important to make sure that uh, our youth are not lacking behind. And it is essential for us to encourage them and uh, help them to succeed in the next generation. Mrs. Bolanle Sarumia Liu, the Senior Special Assistant to Governor Shei Makinde, commended the foundation for the laudable initiative which she said deserved to be supported. We have to recognize the efforts the Oyoske government has put greatly into education. Uh, no government before this government had, uh, had uh, increased their budget, education budget, to more than 20%. Mr. Dare Adeleke, the chairman, Pace Setter Transport Company, and chairman of the occasion, commended Kumolafe and appreciated the laudable initiative of the foundation. When you look at the concept of the stamps, you realize what it involves. It's a capacity science and the engineering in particular. We need to approach it, like the Alfred Komolafe Foundation. We want so many foundations that have to come up. Dr. Nureni Adeniron, the chairman of the State Universal Basic Education Board, represented by Sibeb's executive secretary, Mr. Lusanjo Adeniye, also commended Komolafe for the laudable initiative saying the state government is ready to collaborate on every developmental effort. The government cannot do it all. So I believe one of the areas through which this can be done is for the government to possibly encourage the NGOs and um, good attend individuals to support the government. The event featured presentation of awards to some dignitaries, launching of the UTME STEM clinic and inauguration of a modern borehole constructed by the foundation.